towel neck t-shirts. Kinda rad. Kinda expensive. Kinda going to make my own with two old t-shirts. Still learning. First, you'll need to find the shirt that you're going to put your cowl neck on. This one will do. Then grab some chalk and decide how much of your collar you want to cut out. I went about two inches out from each side of the collar, chalked where I was going to cut, and took the scissors to it. I cut a little deeper in the front of the shirt so that there's more cowl up there, I guess. Now bust out your measuring tape and find the circumference of your collar. Mine sits at 30 inches. Next, grab a second shirt that you don't really give a shit about. I haven't worn this shirt in like six months because it fits weird, but has this rad fading flannel pattern on it. Perfect candidate. Cut the shirt off right underneath the arms. Pin it together if you want it all even and fancy. Remove the pins and you're left with your tubular piece of fabric. Next, take the circumference of your shirt. Again, mine's 30 inches. Drop a couple inches in there for seam allowance, which brings us up to 32 inches. Then divide that number by two since your fabric is already doubled over. This brings us to 16 inches. Measure that out, chalk your cut line, and cut off the excess fabric. Then flip your fabric inside out so that the right sides are facing together. And sew a zigzag stitch from the top to the bottom. And you've just made a cowl neck. Now flip your t-shirt inside out and your cowl neck right side out. Everybody with me? All right, now take your cowl neck and tuck it into your shirt like so and work it around the collar. The two right sides of your shirt should be facing each other like this. Now loosely pin the two collars and with a zigzag stitch, slowly sew them together. You'll never really see this part of the shirt, so if you f it up, don't worry too much. And just like that, your two shirts are magically fused together forever. You're pretty much done at this point. I wanted to add some drawstrings to it, so I made a simple hem by folding the top of the cowl neck over and giving it a quick stitch. I marked out where I wanted the drawstrings, snipped some holes for them, and ran this cool shoelace which I've had forever through to the other side. Yeah, this is probably now one of the coolest shirts that I own. I threw on a vest with it and thought that looked pretty snazzy. All in all, pretty excited about it. Heck, between this shirt and the one that I made last week, my closet's getting pretty awesome. Click on this video for more life-altering DIY, and then click on that big red button to subscribe if you haven't already. See you next time.